Hi, welcome to my um to the first Java video. And in this video I'll be um exp you know coding the first assignment I had in college and I'm you know I just feel like I should do it because most people really started and you know going into college and they don't know what they're doing they've never had any programming um language skill or experience and I was that way too and I'm you know I'm still learning and but you know I always go to YouTube I'm still going to YouTube to look for different assignments but I never get what I really want because everyone just did what do whatever they want and I just feel like I should do this just for those people who might have the same assignment as I do and this is a college assignment so um and the assignment um right here is just a simple assignment that says write a program that asks the user to enter a five digit positive integer using only the um divide and percent operation compute each digit and display the sum of the digits here's a sample you know run whatever they say and they just give us an example of how to do it they you know and bam that was like the second week of come into college. So what we want to do first is create a scanner. Um so we can so we're able to input um the integers in the scanner. Um without without because if we don't create a scanner we can't really type in any um integers into with the keyboard so i'm creating a scanner i name it keyboard that scans the keyboard and returns every any value that the um that we put in from the keyboard and now i'm going to ask um the user to enter a five five digit integer So that is just a comment. It's always good to use comments because then you know what you're doing and what you need to do next. So here it is printing out um, a five digit positive integer. So we know what integers are. You know, they're all, they're whole numbers. They're not decimal, they're just whole numbers and you know, if you were gonna print decimal, we'll be using spring on uh, spring. Um, but we're not. We'll be using string. Sorry, I said spring. I was like, what? So, int. Um, I'm gonna give my int an um a variable called numbers equals to, and I'm gonna call my KB, which is my keyboard dot next int. And this is really good, that option, because it just helps you um, format what you need. To, you know, sometimes you can go through there and be like, oh, I think I can use that. Um, so now I'm going to write a you know, comment to calculate integer. I'm going to calculate the integer. Um, and then because it said write. Uh, enter a five digit positive integer. I'm gonna write five different integers. So for each num for each of the for each number, so each integer, I'll, I'll write a statement for that. So it's int first. Now is a first number equals. So you can name it whatever you want, but you always want to name it something that um you can relate to later. Someone else can understand for your from your code. So I first. First number equals numbers, which is I'm putting in the first number into this keyboard. And when I type from the keyboard, it gives me the first number basically. And then second number equals to number. Oh, it should be numbers. And then they said we should use the percent sign, um, the divide sign, and then the percent sign. So now you. You want to go back and read what this um, what it does, what those um, sent sign and divide sign does. And basically, they just either divide or 
um, the percent sign is actually weird. It gives you like the remainder. I used to, like, when I started, I was like, why, you should just give, divide and give me um, the number and there's remainder, but basically it doesn't do that. It gives you just only the remainder. Um, right, right. C one three four one three one three four. Yeah, nine ten. No. So int total plus to f no. Plus, plus phenom. Now that is just adding those numbers together to give us the result. And why we did this right here is so that we can actually, you know, give an accurate um, what's it called? we can accurately um, put all the numbers together. But you want to read about it um, to that way you get a full understanding of what it does. <sighs> yeah, I don't want that there. I want it to be num. X is F I T S N U. Okay. Now, this is where it actually would give you the print result. And display. So, Now we want to print out those numbers and the result. This enables us we'll be able to print out the numbers and the result together. The sum of the digits uh, we want that is right there plus um. Plus, yes, um, plus. So you you know why we're basically doing that? Um, that is to be able to print um a plus. If not all num all the numbers would just be together. So, yeah, I'm not really good at explaining stuff. Um, mostly don't know how to explain to myself either. Just have to like, it's also good to have like a UML diagram um, of what you want to do. That also... I miss a plus right here. That's why it's giving me that weird. So equals to. Now we want to print out the total. So. We basically can just write here. 
So we can just right here, enter. So this is the code and go ahead and run it. All right, try. So it wants me to put numbers down there. Enter and it gives me the number. It only gives me five of it. I should have put only five because I only did five numbers. So I'll, but I wanted to give me the numbers up here. So I'll go over here and I'll take out this IN so it doesn't print to the next line and I'll write it again. So right there, three, four, two, two, one, two, three, five numbers. Enter. The sum of the digits is three plus six plus five plus four plus three is equals to 21. And that is how you write a code. That is the code for an assignment when they ask to write, write a program that asks the user to enter a five digit positive integer using only the divide and percent operation, compute each digit, which is show each digit and display the sum of the digits. So there you go. If you like this video and you know, want more assignment down here, which I will be doing, you know, you could subscribe and, you know, get notified when a new assignment is out.